Hi guys. If you've seen my other videos, particularly the first one, you will know that this channel is primarily editorial. It is coming from my point of view, my personal opinions on feminism and basically putting it on trial and all the aspects and all of the things that it has created, examining those things and really taking a hard look at how prolific feminism is and from whence it came. We don't all have to agree on that. But one of the things that makes me sort of extreme and um, makes it so that it's, it's very hard to find women who agree with me. In fact, I've never found one. But um, I'm actually pro MGTOW. I, I want there to be a safe place for men from feminism because feminism has led to where men are physically abused and cannot retaliate, obviously, even to contain the situation without terrible consequences um, by the state, usually. Um, we, I, I think it's just better if men don't get themselves involved in a state marriage contract or anything that's close to that because it just puts them at risk for losing um, everything they've worked for and losing children that may come out of that union. It's terribly painful and too many men have had to go through it. I think um, especially if you live on the coasts or in the big cities, MGTOW's a real answer for people. And again, if you don't know and you haven't watched my other videos, MGTOW stands for men going their own way. It's when they say, you know what? Mm -mm. I choose not to engage. I choose not to participate with women, it's too risky. Um, men are getting accused of things right and left and there's no due process for them with this whole believe women and me too. You're supposed to believe women no matter what they say. That means men are guilty no matter what they say. Um, if you're MGTOW, you rarely will be in a room with a woman alone without a camera or a witness or something because you understand the threat. And it is a threat. Um, Women aren't these little innocent angels. It's part of the reason feminism was able to sneak up on so many of us. It's because so many of us fought the whole sugar and spice and all things nice. So I like for men to be safe from that. It's also, in a way, I look at it as a natural way for the market, so to speak, to correct itself. Like men being on strike. I think in my maybe overly optimistic way that perhaps some women will take note and correct or the state will realize, wait a minute, men aren't getting married. They should start to realize now because statistics are showing that men are less likely to join in a union with a woman. It's just too risky. Some of the problems I have with it are not the problems other women have with it. Um, but a problem I have with it is just, it's very misunderstood. And that's because they don't give a crap if anyone understands. Because <laughs> they're already out. They're peace out. They're gone. They're like, eh, they'll figure it out or they won't. So it's hard for it to correct the market if no one knows why. So that's kind of why I try to share it here and there where I feel like it's safe and I won't get doxxed or canceled or worse. Um, it's not sustainable for a healthy future for our species. Good Lord, I almost said race and that's not what I meant. I meant species. Um, and if you think about it, it only leaves the irresponsible dumbasses behind to procreate. <laughs> and so the people who, who are aware and intelligent, they're the ones going, those are the men going, nope. And so they're not having children. So you're left with the, you know, the prodigy of the, of the irresponsible. So good Lord, let's, women, we gotta fix it. 
we got to fix ourselves. We got to start being accountable. We've got to start bringing something to the table as literally like dinner. Um, we need to be, we need to give them a reason to stay. We need to not make it risky. We need to stop accusing them. And the only way I see it ever getting better is if women correct the other women because Lord knows they're not going to listen to a man. So that's why I am pro make Tao because I want the men that I love and all the men that I have never met before to be safe from this horrible, horrible tragedy that is feminism and everything it's done to our society. It's awful. So you go your own way. Good. Godspeed.